it's clear that when I've seen, um, spoke to companies, there are, that often they work in silos. You know, you've got marketing here and you've got PR there and you've got finance and then you've got production and so on. What are your thoughts on how that's going to change, how companies should now integrate all these functions in terms of social media activity? What sort of things, what sort of steps should companies take in changing the way they work? So kind of going back a little bit to your previous question, you know, what are the problems of PR companies facing? Yeah, they've been managing conversations for, for, for the company for a long period of time, but social media is not just about managing conversations. Social media is a way of interacting with our staff, interacting with our clients, our suppliers. It's a way of uh, empowering our consumers. It's about reviews, it's about communities, it's about the processes you talk about. And realistically, can a PR company do all of that? Can we outsource a component to one company or do we need to as a business recognize that social media is just something that needs to go across the business and yeah how do you address that I think looking from a company point of view anyways I mean a lot of my clients and a lot of the people that I work with are marketing people and I you know speak at marketing conferences etc um, and what I tell them is that Although social media has traditionally been owned by, by marketing, that can't remain to be the case going forward. You, you, as a marketing person, needs to empower the rest of your business to get behind this. So rather than trying to think of it as losing power or losing that ownership, think of it as empowering your business and being a thought leader and being the ambassador and an enabler of social media as opposed to a, a, someone guarding or trying to protect your, your interests. So, for example, initiating some sort of center of excellence or some sort of work group that pulls in not just marketing resources headed up by, by yourself, but also um, people that represent customer service, people that represent product development or HR even, you know, how can HR leverage social media? And help them to understand about best practices in different verticals and show them how you've been using Twitter so they can see how they can replicate that for, for their objectives within their business areas. So, back to your question. Social media definitely needs to filter through the entire organization. Marketing has a, has a good chance to be the people kind of advocating that or enabling that. Um, and then again, how does, what relevance does a PR company have in that big scheme? I'm not so sure. I think PR is good for managing maybe customer relationships, but I don't think they can own and successfully manage that whole integrated, holistic view of social media that I'd like to see companies embracing going forward. So.